that uh, didn't have an opportunity to to uh, to do a whole lot last year. But you look at a guy potentially like Gabe Richardson and and um, and, and, and Mario. Um, guys like that, I know he was hurt. So I mean, there's there's some some guys that we're going to be able to take a good look at in the spring to evaluate to see if they can do what we need them to do on the edge. What's Sosa's ideal weight, and is he can he move around? Do you, do you think? Because you mentioned him on the edge, but he was big to play inside last year. Sosa's athletic, you know. Um, that's the thing, you know. I, I've said that. I think I said this last year. Sosa has uh, next level. Ability and you know one of the things that you'll find out about the rush ends on that level they can be that big and rush. Uh, I, I think Sosa has elite athleticism and he, quickness, uh, so I, I think he can do it. You know, obviously you don't want him 310, 315, but that's not Sosa's body type anyway. You know, he'll be somewhere I would say in the, between 275, 300 range and be, be athletic and quick. You know, because I think I think he played at about 285 or 290 last year. What's your take on the newcomers you got coming in, full wider and the rest of them? Super excited. You know, I had the chance to really get to know uh, Nick through the recruiting process, and uh, I'm excited about him. He's a he's a long, athletic uh, defensive end, something that you want for your edge rushers here. So he'll fit really well into what we're doing. Uh, super excited that Isaiah Nichols is already here. Really impressed with him in camp. And uh, he had a great year this year, and uh, I'm excited about B.J. Farrell. That kid can move. He's a big kid. He's strong. He's powerful. He's got basketball player type feet. Uh, so I'm, I'm excited about him. What what he could do. Coach, what's the biggest difference you've seen between the players? You know, just having uh, seen the last regime and these new coaches come in. What's the biggest kind of difference? Like attitude, uh, excitement. What's the biggest thing? Well, you know, um, you know, when there's when there's change. Uh, a lot of times that, that gives players fresh starts. You know how that goes. There's new optimism. Uh, so you, you, you've seen that. You know, kids are trying to elevate. Uh, some kids feel like they'll, it has created an opportunity for them. So, uh, but, you know, our, our kids want to win. Any, anytime you go through a four and eight football season, nobody likes that. So I, I think our kids are motiva- motivated by saying, we got to do better. We got to work harder. Let's push harder. You know, some of the things that we did last year didn't work last year. Let's let's open our, our minds and ideals up to something new and let's buy in. Let's let's try to go win more games this year.